All right, so I'm up for another sketch session. <clears throat> um, I did an extra one yesterday. This was yesterday's one, and I did another page there in pencil. Um, but yeah, I want to. I don't know. The pencil doesn't really show up that well, and I've got all these pens, so I'm just going to tip it out. I've just tipped it out and I'm just going to go through and see what I can find to use because some of these are gel pens I don't know if they work um, but I've got so many of them that if they don't work I really should just throw them out but anyway that's what I'm going to use today just put my camera back I'll be using I'll be doing figures again might feel like lately I'm all I'm doing is figures, but that's because I feel like I need the most practice. Um, I get the I get rusty the most on figures and um, heads, people's heads. So I do have some references here. I will put put them up on the screen. Now I've made them black and white. Obviously I've got some color pens that I can use. So I'm not. I've, I've got no idea what I'm doing. I'll tell you right now I've got no idea what I'm doing <laughs> but that's the beauty of some of these sketch sessions so this morning it's going to be all about really exploring these figures I've, I'm, I also I also did a blind drawing session today which I, I really enjoyed um, oh geez decisions decisions let's just make a decision I think I've I think I've <laughs> I think I've hurt myself here by having so many choices so I'm just gonna pick a biro <laughs> after all that. I will use some of the other ones um, but to start off with actually I might use let's just see if this works kind of doesn't really show up though does it oh yeah a little bit all right let's let's start with this pen pen not pencil see how we go we'll just go with the first figure I'll put my timer down here. Right. It's it's very hard to show up, isn't it? I might switch this out. But I just want to get the basics of this form down in something that I can more easily uh, go over if I feel I need to. Well, I think I've made her a little bit wider than what she actually is. So let's just fix that. I'm just going to draw these legs together like a mermaid. Made her a little bit short. Better. All right, let's pick qu quickly. We have to go quick. <laughs> Blue. Actually, that's what I might do. Is I might just make it that I um, I don't look at the pen that I'm picking up. Just doing this leg section. I don't know why. I just feel like doing the leg section. So it's my morning sketch, and I'll do <laughs> I'll do what I want. If you hear machinery outside, it's just the <clears throat> back neighbours doing some work after the storms we had that, that um, saw a lot of trees, a lot of gum trees fall and make a big mess everywhere. We, we, we don't really get, I mean, we get summer storms, but the storm that we had was just out of this world. I've made a mistake with the foot, that's fine. This is getting too nitpicky. Just caught myself. Is this 
sketch. It's not a finished piece of artwork. There we go. She's on a bit of a lean. That's my mistake. I don't think she's leaning that much. Also, I think I made this arm a little bit too big, but that's fine. It's just a sketch. Just have to keep reminding yourself every time you start picking at your work. Just remember what it is. It's just a sketch. It's just a throwaway sketch. Although don't throw them away, I do suggest you keep them. Oh. Mouths can be really atrocious if you start trying to put too much detail in. I'll just zoom in a little bit with my camera. As best I can. Yeah, there you go. Right, let's see. Um, just quickly get a little bit of colour, different colour in there, I guess. There we go. Bit of a blue jacket. All right, let's go for the next one. She's sitting down. Is this going to be a tough? This is a tough one. This is going to be a tough one. I'll use. Uh, I've got no idea where that green pen went. It disappeared. Oh, here it is. Here it is. I've got it. The world is saved. <laughs> Good. I'm going to need it with this one. All right, let's get started with the next one. Whoops and see what we can do. I feel like I recently did one with a hat. Did I? Yeah, I did. Not the same, not the same picture though. might be hard to see what I'm doing. One of these days I'll get a better camera. Just don't have the money for it. And I don't want to complain about it. <laughs> I really don't. That's what I got and that's it. There we go. I find sometimes if if things are really hard, if I'm finding them really hard to draw, just to um, cut them up into sections. Right, this hand is a little, this is a little bit off here. Should be a leg. All right, let's just make this bigger. All right, let's go with. Uh, I was going to do line pick. I'm not looking at the. No, that's not that's not going to show up, is it? We'll soon find out. Is that showing up? I guess. Kind of. Mm 
kind of, yeah, I guess it shows up enough. Perspective is pretty bad, but I'm not trying to do perspective. This this face is going to be. <laughs> I don't know. Let's just put an indication from the arm and the. And that will do and let's see <laughs> I've got a minute to go let's see how I can mess up this face just putting marks Of course she's smiling too, which is something that I find very difficult. I'll have to practice drawing smiles at some stage. I might do a morning sketch session just of smiles. Twelve seconds. I didn't, I didn't, uh, that was number one, that was number two, is this bleeding through, kind of, nah, whatever, all right, so let's see if we can get one more in, I've got two to choose from, and I think I'm only going to fit, I'm not going to fit the full figure in, I'm, I'm going to have to choose the, uh, do a three quarter, another lady in a hat, all right, let's find that green pen, which actually really worked as an under, Underpen. Not underpants, underpen. Well they're not wearing underpants anyway, they're wearing swimwear. Because I can get quite sketchy with this. No deja vu. Because I've done this before. Maybe I've done this actual I don't know, that's weird. I mean I do do a lot of sketch. I don't know, that's just weird. I just had a really, really hard case of deja vu. <laughs> oh, I, don't, I don't know how to feel about that. That's all we're going to fit in there. So let's just draw this negative space. Just so I can figure a few things out. Unfortunately, I think it's going to cover the other one. That's, that's fine. It's a sketchbook. It's not, I mean, I've seen, I've seen on YouTube people have these perfect sketchbooks and I'm like, oh man, that's depressing because mine are never going to be like that. Mine are always going to look like this. And I don't want to be ashamed of my sketchbook because it's messy and I don't want you to be ashamed of your sketchbook either because that's just how it is. You know, if you can't draw perfectly, um, I'm over dwelling on it. I really am. Because it just makes it so much harder for you to enjoy. You just lose you just lose the passion for drawing and for art in general. And I get too much out of it to, to want to risk that. 
But it's just, I, yeah, there's just too much. Art gives too much for me to risk um, stopping enjoying it. All right, let's go. What have we got? This one. All right, okay. Oh, gosh, I'm drawing off the screen again. Sorry. Oh, I kick myself up the butt for that. Okay, let's start with the top. Hands. I have to. I have moved that hand by accident. That's, that's okay. Let's do this hand. Join those two fingers together just to make it easier. And then draw the underneath, draw underneath here. And that will make your hand look less. You can do that if you want. Really shouldn't have, but anyway. If you draw underneath it, it makes it less alien, like it more identifiable as a hand, I find. Oh, a minute to go. We don't have the face in yet. Oops. Probably down here. Okay. See, sometimes just putting little marks like that can be enough for you to get the picture in your mind and then work from there uh, when it comes to doing faces. At least that's what I find. It's not always accurate, as we'll probably find out now. 25 seconds, can I get an eye in here? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Just, all right, that'll do for the eye. <laughs> if I do any more, I'm gonna stuff it up. This mouth is hard. Just do a pillow for the bottom. Ooh, there we go. Oops. I just, I just want to, I know it's over the timer, but oh, I, I really have to practice with lips, I think. And it, she's got big earrings. We didn't, we, really, we didn't really get to go over that um, figure that much, but anyway, that's three. Just put the date down today. All right, so that's what we've got. I'll zoom out. This one's a bit hard to see. There we go. Because it blends in with the with the light because it's a gel pen, so. Yeah, all right. Well, those are our figures for today. And like I said, the reason why I've just been doing a lot of figures lately is because I do get really rusty with them and I find that if I don't keep drawing them that I end up drawing really horribly, so um, that's the reason for that. And it hasn't bled through the page too much. That's the page, so that's all right. And that's it. That's it for today's sketch session. I hope you joined along, and I will see you for the next one in a couple of days, probably next week. And uh, I'll keep drawing, everyone. Now I have to put all of these pens away. Ah, oh, mess. So many pens.